Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, my beautiful Taurus? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you come across this reading. I hope everyone is staying safe. I love you guys. To all of my subscribers, my new subscribers, <laughs> I really appreciate y'all. Thank you so much for your beautiful, kind words. Trust and believe. There's so many comments. I can't keep up with them, but just know that I see you. I see you all and I appreciate you. Okay. To new viewers, cross watchers, come on in, take what resonates, and leave the rest for someone else. We're going to get started, Taurus. So, as I was meditating and I was asking Spirit Guides, Divine Universe, God, whoever you believe in, Taurus, what is the message for you? What is it that you need to know? And Spirit Guides just clearly said, but this time, I'm like, what do you mean? I, I don't understand. What, do, what are you talking about? Spear guys, divine guys say, but this time. So we're going to find out because I'm like, I, I, I don't understand. I guess as I go through your reading, I'm going to understand what spear guys, divine universe, God, ancestors, Archangel, Michael, Gabriel, Ariel is saying. All I know they say, but this time, spirit guys, what's the energy for Taurus? What's the energy? Three cards just came out. Oh my goodness. But this time, but this time you have appreciation. You have indecision and you have doors opening. But this time, things is about to be different, Taurus. There is a decision. There is something that you're at a crossroad about. But Spirit Guides is saying, but this time, you in decision. You in a decision. You're trying to make your mind up which direction to go when it comes down to your money flow. Because I feel as though that you are around a lot of hostile environment, hostile people. I feel as though that you're not being appreciated or your value. They, they don't respect who you really are and you, and you ready to make a decision. You're at a crossroad that you want to go somewhere that you're more appreciated but spirit said, but this time spirit guys is also telling me in your energy, but this time I'm about to open up doors. I'm about to shake your foundation. I'm about to start open the up floods of income for you. That can't nobody shake it. Can't nobody touch it. Yeah, yeah, there are some decisions to be made, Taurus, and you know it. You got, l let me tell you something. It's about your money. The woman holding the pinnacles or the man holding the pinnacles, it does not matter. Whatever this decision is, Taurus, that you're about to make uh, concerning your money, your money floor, the door to value, the door to making up, making more money. Divine God is saying the de that decision that you want to make. Yeah, that decision. Yeah, yeah, that one, that one that holds the key. That one, this one says, but this time where you were you thinking about going with the decision you're trying to make this time I am about you're about to be. Yeah, you're going to make you, make that decision. This time it's going to be different. You're going to be appreciated. You're going to you're going to you're going to you're going to bring the bank home. Oh, yeah, your worth, your value. Your confidence is going to get you this job. Sometimes it's time to stop holding on to things that you know you're not being valued as or being valued. My goodness, 
I'm talking to somebody. Whatever this indecision. And I feel like it has something to do with where there's somebody or something or some situation does not appreciate you. And you know, because you're standing tall, you know your worth. You know you have that gift. You have the skills. You have the confidence. Yeah. But you're at a crossroad. Should I take it or should I leave it? Should I take it or should I stay? Should I go? Should I stay? Mm hmm. Spirit guys, what is the affirmation for Taurus? What is Taurus affirmation? Can't make it up. Abundance, baby. Abundance. You go towards the abundance because when you take make this decision, the right decision. The decision of abundance that just came out into your energy. Abundance, abundance, abundance. Look at here. Yeah. Aim towards your what your happiness. You are attracting abundance into your life each day from all possibilities and directions. Honey, you're about to be sitting large if you take this new opportunity. This new opportunity, this new this new job is, is going, this new career is going to take off. You're going to have so much flow of income. But this time. In the past, spirit guys is telling me, Taurus, that you was not valued. You were not appreciated. They overlooked you. They, 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 they took your ideas and they kept it and, and, and they paid you less than what you deserve more. But spirit guys are saying, but this time, but this time you are attracting some beautiful things in your life. And spirit guys are saying, I'm about to bless you. And can't nobody shake your foundation. No one is going to be able to shake your foundation. They may try to come against you, but they will not prosper. Oh, this is for quite few of you. Abundance is on the horizon. It's a decision you need to make. Spirit guys, another affirmation for Taurus. Balance. This is going to give you the direction. This is going to give you what it is that you've been looking for. Balance. Not struggling anymore. Not trying to make ends meet. But you're going to be balanced. You're going to be able to pay your bills and to be able to get the things that you need to get. To get the things that you want. You're going to have options. You're being blessed. You are attracting abundance in your life. Whatever vibration that a lot of you are on. You are creating your reality. That means that you're walking in your abundance. You're walking in your abundance. You are walking in your blessing. And spirit guides say, but this time, but this time spirit guides are saying, I am, God is getting ready to invest in you. You, do you understand? Do you understand where I'm getting? Just, 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 just hold on. Just hold on tight with me. You'll get the message. Spirit guys, divine say, I'm a, I am getting ready to invest in you because you have done so much work. You have made it through a lot of tests. See the spirit guys, divine God has tested you several times, more than one time, two, three, four, five times. Sometimes we have to repeatedly take a test over and over until we get it. You finally pass that test. And Spirit Guy said, I'm getting ready to invest in you. Not Joe, Paul, Susie, Q, none of them. God, divine universe is getting ready to invest in you. He trusts that you're going to do the right thing. So that's why this door is about to open. That's why your life is about to change. But this time, spirit guy said, I'm investing in you. But this time, things is going to be different. But this time, because you're allowing God to do it this time, you're not putting your foot in it. You're not making a mess of it. But this time, God said, now I'm going to show you. 
I'm of investing you and look at the pinnacles that you're holding in your hand. You're about to be setting large. I don't know who this is for, but your appreciation spirit guys is saying they appreciate you. You are valuable. This blessing, this new career is about to balance you, you and your family, your children. You're about to be balanced. You're about to so much abundance. You uh, uh, can't nobody shake your foundation. The wind may blow. The windows may bust out, but your house ain't moving. You understand what I'm saying? That's because God divine universe is is committing is is investing in your blessing oh my goodness let me say that again spirit guys divine god is committing investing in your blessing see you're manifesting this you you are attracting this abundance in your life that's why you're coming to an indecision you come into a conclusion where oh my goodness i don't know uh I've been with this company. I've been with this in this career. Oh, I, I got to shift to another career. And oh my goodness, what if, what if spirit God's divine God said, I got you. You got to believe it. You got to believe this is your reality. This is your story. You manifesting this, you are attracting abundance in your life. Nobody can take that away from you because what's for you is for you and no one is going to be able to shake your foundation. I don't know who this is for, but you are about to this decision, this indecision that you need to make is clearly showing here that you need to make the right one, which is all about abundance and doors opening up and you holding the pinnacles, whether it's a woman holding the pinnacles or there is a man holding the pinnacles and spirit. God said, keep the faith because I'm God divine is about to show up in your life and, and, and you're going to know it come from nobody, but God universe divine faith. Keep the faith. Keep the faith spirit guys is saying. I have faith in myself and the universe that together we will orchestrate and manifest my heart's desire. Keep the faith. But this time. Spirit guide says, I'm investing in you. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> but this time. <laughs> But this time I'm investing in you because I see you. Divine God said, I see you. Mm hmm. Yeah. That, 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 that rough road, a lot being weighed on you, having it. Mm hmm. That's what the 10 of swords is. The 10, the 10 of, yeah, the 10 of wands, a lot of stress, a lot of heavy burdens, a lot of heavy burdens. But you're at the end of that rope, honey. If you make that move and go towards whatever this door is about to start your flow of income, no more, no more heavy burdens, no more, no more everything being weighed on your back. Everything has been weighed on you. You have been pushing. You have been looking here. You've been, it's been a long time. You've been just holding stuff on. You've been holding on to other people's baggage. You've been letting everything weigh on, on you. And now you're at the end of the rope. Now you're at the end of that. It is over. The, 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 the ten of wands. A lot of burdens weighing on you. No more. That is about to be over. You're about to be successful. You're about to be successful. Spirit guys, tell me more. No more heavy burden. Spirit God says this time, but this time things are going to be different. But this time, this time I'm going to show you, but this time you're going to know it's from me, God, divine universe, whoever you believe in, you're going to know. But this time, you're not, you're no more feeling lonely, no more feeling uh, like this. Ten of cups. No more of this. 
up at night. Just stuff just is it, just can't sleep. Weighing on you heavy. But this time, spirit guy said, I'm about to pour you out a blessing, baby. You ain't going to have to worry about nothing. Can't nobody shake your foundation. You also got a commitment coming in. Someone that's coming in that wants to also uh, uh, commit to you. Wants to ask you out. Oh, my goodness. Messages everywhere. World card. Page of Pentacles. I told you commitment, new beginnings, out with the old, in with the new. I feel as though a lot of you are taking this new proposition, this new, this new journey of a new career, of a new job that's making more money and you're going to be appreciated. You're going to be valued. And this is a foundation nobody can take from you. Because spirit guys, you're going to be in your boss energy, baby. You're going to be in authority. You're going to be over people. I just got that in my spirit. You're going to be over people. And a lot of you are about to take that leap of faith and start this new beginning. You're going to be over people. You're going to be a boss, honey. Yes, you're going to be a boss. You've done so much work. Look at that. So much work. Page of Wands. Messages coming in. Moving forward, baby. Moving forward. Spirit guys say, what I have done, but this time. This time I'm going to show you that I appreciate you and you're going to be very happy. 10, 10 is here. 10 of cups. Sunshine to me is 10. You're about to take a new leap of faith. You're about to be a boss. You're about to be over people. Page of Pentacles. That's a, that's a, a promotion. Page of Pentacles, a new beginning, a promotion. Some of you are trying to think, should I take this promotion that I'm going to be a supervisor? I'm going to be a boss. I'm going to be a GM. I'm going to be over a lot of people. Take it. Take it. Leap of faith right here. Take it. Spirit guides is saying, but this time you, you definitely pass through that old cycle and you're starting a new cycle this time. <laughs> A lot of you walked away and you're going straight to being who you are meant to be. Yes, you walked away from that very thing and you're going towards that, that higher up job, that, that job that appreciates you more. You walked away from something old, an old job in a better career. You go, go Taurus. You manifested this baby. What? You manifested this, honey. Look at here. You manifested this. Yes, you did. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Look at here. You manifested this beautiful abundance. Look at that. Ten of Pentacles, baby. Ten, ten. Yes, you did. You, how do you, your hair is in the wind. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Yes, you did. Spirit God said, but this time you're going to get, you're going to reap, you're going to sow, and you're going to, everything that you sowed. You're reaping all of your rewards. The Ten of Pentacles here. You're going to have options. You're gonna <laughs> Look at here. Look at there. Look at here. Spirit God said, but this time, but this time, honey, you are on your way. Ace of Pentacles. You get ready to get a message very soon. Somebody going to call you back on the interview. You're going to be stable. You're going to have options in the Ten of Pentacles. I can't make this up.